Are you a streamer looking to grow your audience and build a community? I'm going to show you how to use social media to take your stream to the next level. Let's dive in. First off, let's talk about why social media is so important for streamers. Platforms like Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, and Facebook aren't just for sharing selfies and memes. They're a powerful tool to connect you with your audience, promote your content, and engage with your community. With the right strategy, you can attract more viewers and keep them coming back for more. Choosing the right platform is crucial. Each social media site has its own strengths, so let's break it down. Twitter or X. Great for real-time updates, engage with your audience, and network with other streamers. Instagram. Perfect for sharing behind-the-scenes content, clips, and engaging visuals. Facebook. Useful for building community groups and diverse audience. TikTok, ideal for short, engaging clips that can go viral and attract a younger audience. Let's talk about engaging content. Your goal is to grab the attention of your audience, encourage interaction. Here are some tips, clips and highlights. Share the best moments of your stream. These can be funny, what? exciting, or emotional highlights that showcase your personality. Behind the scenes, give your audience a peek behind the curtain. Share your setup, your process, and what goes on when you're not streaming. Polls and questions and answers. Engage with your followers by asking questions and encouraging them to share their opinion. It's a great way to build a community and get feedback. Collaboration. Team up with other streamers and content creators. This can introduce your channel to a whole new audience. Consistency is key when it comes to social media. Post regularly to keep your audience engaged and keep you top of mind. Here are some tips to stay consistent. Create a schedule. I've gone over this and over this and over this about creating a schedule schedule, not just for your stream, but also a posting schedule. Make sure that you are planning your posts in advance. I have all of my Twitter posts already on auto post for the month of July, if that tells you anything. Keep a content calendar of what you want to share and when you want to share it. Use scheduling tool. Not every single social media platform has a scheduler in advance, so you're going to need third party tools to be able to do this. You got Hootsuite, Buffer, or Later can help you schedule your posts so you can focus on streaming. Stay active. Engage with your audience by replying to comments. Consistency is key. Finally, analyze and adapt. Use the analytic tools to figure out what is working for your content and what isn't. Pay attention to metrics like engagement, reach, and follower growth. This data will help you refine your strategy and improve your content. I really hope that these few points help you figure out which social media site is best for you. Remember, only focus on one platform at a time as multiple platforms can get a bit overwhelming. Use this as a learning opportunity for for a better strategy for your content. Guys, I really hope this video helped you. And if it did, make sure you go ahead and hit that sub button and give this video a like if you learned something new. Also, before you go, make sure you check out this video right here, which can help you with figuring out what I use to plan out my entire month's strategy. Guys, I appreciate you being here and I catch you in the next one. Bye guys.